hello guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video thought we'd do a little daily vlog today can i just say it is freezing i don't know what's happened overnight because yesterday it wasn't like this but this morning i had to defrost the car for the first time it was like thick ice and it was frosty and it's so cold and i can't warm up and honestly i feel like winter's here am i mad about it no i feel really cozy but equally it's so cold so before we jump in to the video this part of the video is kindly sponsored by my vegan and my protein and i'm so excited to share some of these pieces with you because if you watch the vlogs for a long time you'll know that i'm a customer of my protein and i have been for such a long time their protein this one in particular has been my ride or die for the past few years it's pretty much one of the only proteins that i can actually drink because i never used to like like the thick textured protein this changed the game for me my friend introduced it to me and i've never looked back so I'm super excited to be working with them on this part of the video. I did a huge order and I mean huge. I stocked up on so many bits, stocked up on things that I've used before and love and I've stocked up on new things which I'm really excited to try. So I thought we'd kick off this video with a little haul. I'll leave links in the description down below to shop my protein along with my code which is Dion and I think that should get you 50% off but it is going to change over the next few weeks so keep an eye out and I will have it in the description box below. Okay let's start with this because obviously this is a holy grail it's a product which I've bought so many times before and I've also got so many people onto it because I just rave about it it's the best protein ever. So this is their clear wear isolate in the peach tea flavour this is so good because it is almost just like a fruit juice like you know dilute like dilute -y juice that you add to water this is what this tastes like so i'll just have it like with my dinner as a juice as a nice drink but i'm still getting my protein in i only like the thicker like normal protein if i'm putting it with like a banana and making a smoothie for something thicker i don't like it with just like milk or water whereas this i can just put with water it's less calories and so easy to get your protein in so i had to pick up another one of them and then because i love that so much and it's my favorite product from my protein i thought i'd pick up another flavor to try because there's so many flavors on there and surely if i love the peach tea i'll like some more this one is raspberry lemonade flavor again i feel like this is going to be delicious i'm very excited to try i'll try this today and report back and then another clear protein this one is from my vegan and this is the apple and elderflower one i feel like this one is just going to be nice and refreshing even like adding sparkling water with it that would be a delicious refreshing drink if you ask me um, these are just such a great way to get your protein in and they're lower calories so it's a 10 10 from me i also picked up a new shaker there's another one which is currently on the drying rack there because i used that yesterday but these protein shakers are just again an essential so i stocked up on two of those and then also got some of the impact whey protein so i got the vanilla flavor and i got the chocolate mint flavor like i said if i'm gonna have a smoothie with like fruit banana um oats etc etc i'll use this because it's more of like a thicker don't know the word but like chocolate and vanilla whereas like the peach iced tea is obviously more like juicy does that make sense um so these are good for stuff like that these are great for pancakes i also sometimes mix these in with my oats again i wouldn't really use the clear peach one for that whereas these are a good flavor to mix in with your oats on a morning chocolate mint i'm very excited to try okay some new products which i haven't tried yet and i'm excited to give a go are these sugar free syrups so i got one in maple and one in butterscotch again i thought for pancakes i thought for my oats i thought even to put in smoothies to sweeten them up a little bit these would just be a good little thing to have in the cupboard and to be able to reach for again they had a few more flavors in these so if i like these i will definitely be picking up the other flavors this is a repurchase so this is the flav drops flavor drops don't really know how to say it but I've had these before. I've also had the vanilla and the caramel. My friend got me onto the white chocolate. These in a coffee are so nice. I like to add these to like a latte or a cappuccino when I have my little afternoon coffee and it just gives me that little sweet crave and it feels like you're getting a latte from a coffee shop. They are delicious. This is the white chocolate flavor. 
you literally add one tiny little drop they last forever and it adds such a like a lovely taste this could be used with bacon as well I then picked up some snacks so first up i got these thai sweet chili flavored crisps there's only 99 calories in a bag i am such a snacker and i love crisps crisps are like my weakness crisps and dip honestly one of my favorite snacks um so i thought a little healthy alternative would be a good option these are really nice i actually had a bag yesterday they've been opened just a great little snack to have low in calories and just feels like a little bit of a healthier alternative to bag of crisps and another snack is these baked cookies again i tried these yesterday they are really nice they kind of taste like a protein bar um but more in like a cookie form and a cookie texture these are again because i'm a snacker i'll be able to have one of these with a cup of tea on an afternoon delish and then finally i got these my vegan protein waters again i tried one of these yesterday i tried the berry flavor and it was really nice nice and refreshing and just something a bit different to like an energy drink these have zero sugar in them and six grams of protein so that is everything that i picked up from my protein and my vegan i'll leave it all linked down below along with my code and let's go make some breakfast okay so for breakfast i am having this velvety chocolate oh so simple porridge it's the little sachets i actually think we're running low but these are perfect because i find them really easy to just fill up you basically pour that into a bowl and then put some milk in it put it in the microwave and it's easy and it's so chocolatey and delicious and i feel like when i have this it like it stops my sweet cravings throughout the day because i've had obviously like something chocolatey on a morning and then keep these bars of these my vegan chocolate in the fridge this is the orange flavor this has lasted me two days and i just put two little squares on top of the porridge once it's cooked and it like melts in if you can see that oh my god and it adds like a really nice even more chocolate flavour. And the orange one's really nice. It tastes like a Tori's chocolate orange. And that is my breakfast. It keeps me full, curbs any sweet cravings, and is very yummy. And, of course, accompanied by a cup of tea. So I'm going to dig into this breakfast, and then we'll start work for the day. Hello, Mr. Lou. You look comfy there. Are you watching the England match? It's the first England match. We've got that on in the background. Kobe Lou. Is sat on the couch watching it, aren't you? Little boy, gonna take him out. Oh, big yawn. Gonna take him out this afternoon. And we'll go and see grandma. Okay, so this is like my little compartment in my mum and dad's house where I'm keeping like stuff I've bought for the new house. And I thought I'd show you a few little new bits that I've got. So these, guys, these were from Aldi and they were £9.99 each. They're given white company. My mum even went and bought them for her house because she was like, they are so nice how lovely are them i thought with a nice big pillar candle in on a dining table on a side table they'd just be really nice and i couldn't believe they were 9.99 such a bargain um i don't know if i showed you this stuff did i i really can't remember i feel like i did but if i didn't then i got this little cute marble tray vase little ornament little glass vase there i also got some reed diffusers from this brand which i found online and they looked gorgeous but i mean i'll give you a better unboxing when we're in the new house i'll keep the majority of it secret you've seen the smeg already down there i think you've seen the bath mat but i'm starting to get this little like collection of items that i'm gathering down here um i don't think so actually little lulu okay not gonna lie it is now half two in the afternoon the day has got away with me i've been filming all day and it's time for my coffee break which i literally look forward to every day having my afternoon coffee okay so jordan shouts at me for this i actually really like a instant coffee <laughs> even though we've got a coffee machine that makes like lattes and cappuccinos and all that jazz i just sometimes like a good old instant where is it the one i used in this cupboard i think sometimes a Nescaf Gold just hits the spot. Do you know what I mean? Jordan literally thinks that's criminal of me, but let a girl live. If that hits the spot for my 3 p.m. coffee, it hits the spot for my 3 p.m. coffee. Spoonful of coffee in, little bit of milk 
in. Give it a mix. Let me know if this is how you make your instant coffee. Or are you a watering first type of gal? Because we don't want to burn that coffee. So that's why I do it this way. Adding in the hot water. Give it a little mix. Okay, we've then got the flav drops, which I literally do. Can you see that or not? I tend to do one, two, three, and that's literally enough. That is all you need, and it adds such a nice, sweet syrup flavour. Okay, where's my walking boots? Because my feet have been getting so muddy on dog walks these days. Dog mom walking boots. It's a real fashion icon look if I do say so myself. Big puffer jacket because it is freezing. Oh dear me, dear me, that was a good bark mind, wasn't it, it was a good bark, let's get your collar on, let's get your collar on, clever boy, right, let's go on a walkies, out on a walk, honestly these, um, dark nights I mean and I have to go out on a walk at like three o'clock because I obviously don't want to walk Kobe in the dark and it's getting dark at like quarter to four it is crazy I took him out the other day and it started getting dark and we literally ran home because I was scared <laughs> to be out in the dark I need to get him like a little light up collar um but either way I just don't really like walking in the dark I get a bit scared um, so I've got to like factor in throughout my working day to take him out but then it's really hard when I get back from a walk because it's dark and it's cold and I feel like it's the end of the day but it's not even like five o'clock so I love that for us. Um, also just bumped into my auntie because honestly all my family live in the same area like I can't leave the house without bumping into a family member it is so nice always seeing family out and about um but i'm listening to nearly weds podcast nearly weds is literally my favorite podcast ever it makes me belly laugh out loud in public i was on the train once listening to an episode and i was literally crying laughing and people were looking at me like are you okay it's kind of embarrassing but honestly it's just so funny it's the funniest podcast ever and although it's about them getting married like you can definitely listen to it if you're not getting married it's just such a funny listen um but look at this gorgeous countryside getting the steps in and getting some fresh air <laughs> guys good morning if I don't sound normal, it's because I've just came out the tent. <gasps> oh my god, I just came out the dentist and I can't move. All this, I literally can't feel. I came out and John <laughs> looked at me and I was like, I can't. Oh my god. It looks like I've like... It's all really swollen. <laughs> it's all really swollen and I can't talk and I can't feel like my tongue or anything. I'm having to really think about swallowing and I tried to say something and it just, I just dribbled. And I just had to let you all know <laughs> because I don't know what's going on and I just can't cope. So I've came to hide in the car while Jordan has his appointment. <sighs> How long will this last? Also, because I had my mouth open for so long, <laughs> it just hurts. Oh, God. All I had was one filling because, no, honestly, I'm going to have to cover my mouth because I can't look at it like that. All I had was one filling. Um, I chipped my tooth a while ago. Um, so we got that sorted. Oh, my God. The dentist is such a stressful experience. I have just got back from spinning, just making some salmon, 
with some truffle green beans and new potatoes which are cooking at the minute but I'm gonna try this the raspberry lemonade flavor spinning was so good I actually enjoyed it and I usually don't like evening classes because I like going to the gym first thing on the morning but it felt good let me open this okay water is in let me get the little scoop Add that to the water. Lid. I am a sweaty mess right now. Okay, taste test. Yum. It just tastes like dilute, like when you add a juice with water, and I love a nice juice, so 10 out of 10. I will show you dinner once it's ready. Yum. Where the hell's that? It's in there, the O2. They've turned it into like oh, a... Oh, that's just ridiculous. And this is the squad. Even Colby's up there. Squad goals. Got me, Colby, Wilma, Wilma Lav, Soph. Everyone smile. Hey. Hello guys, good morning. I don't think I vlogged after my trip to the dentist. Thankfully we are back <laughs> to normal. It was a stressful few hours. I was in pain. I couldn't feel my mouth but me and dramatic as always it went in a few hours. So all is well. It is now the next day. Uh, I'm actually just jumping on to wrap up this video because I am just packing for a very 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 exciting shoot in Manchester tomorrow which you will all find out about very soon but I'm so excited to share it with you all. Sophie's actually coming to Manchester with me she's going to come to the shoot and be my little assistant my little helper um, and she'll keep me company for the drive to Manchester. I was going to get the train but they're just quite unreliable at the minute and I feel like I'd rather just be in the comfort of the car with Sophie so all packed ready to go gonna wrap up some work now get this video edited and I will see you in the next video make sure to like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this one make sure to shop my vegan and my protein which will all be linked down below and as always I'll see you in the next one bye